Hello and welcome back to Vox Monday. We are playing as the Mamluks with the intention of taking over India, or most of it, and we're, we're almost done here. Though I suspect that Samarkand may be uh, preparing a sneak attack or something, I am unsure, but they are way ahead of us in technology. As you can clearly see, we are quite behind, especially in military technology, which is incredibly bad for us. Let's see here, do we have anything we want to execute in our decisions or missions? Uh, no, not really. Attack Sutia. Nah. I'd rather go uh, west than east at the moment. For example, do we have a truce with um, Pandua Nadu? We do not. Though we do have a coalition against us. Yeah, everyone is in the coalition against us. Let's take a closer look here. Yeah, Panduanado and Konkana, they are both in the coalition. Currently, I don't think it would be wise to attack them. Though, um, hmm, maybe eventually. I wonder if this guy would be up for vassalization. Absolutely not. Not in the same religious group, twice. Amazing. Anyway, let us start time here, because we, uh, we have a missionary going strong. We need to keep on converting as much as possible. Oh, right, nice. So we can boost uh, him up to a 6 admin guy. Let's um, not... Or oh, should we do that? Ah, oh, it's... Um... Yes. But from now on, we're definitely going to uh, choose new guys. Gain piety and lose more ducats than we have. No. That does not seem like a good idea in any case. Okay, lose piety. It's unfortunate, because now it will take longer to convert, but... We don't really have a choice. The Tamil Patriots. Do I wanna... Attack them or let them siege this down? They have a three fire general. I might... Just accept their demands. I'm not doing anything with this province, am I? No. I am not. 50 military power. No, we need to save our military power. So I'll accept them, because we can't really uh, expend too much manpower. Ooh, bad reputation. That is indeed bad for us. Though Sistan still loves us. Brunei and... Sibir. Right. Should we improve more with Sistan? Yeah, we should. Let's improve. Oh, and we should probably stop improving in Brunei and start fabricating on Panduan Nadu. Let's fabricate on Kanara. Awesome, and we managed to convert Vijayanagar. Next up is maybe Telangana? Actually, let's see. Malabar. Malabar. Well, sure. I'll convert Malabar. Get over there. Quite a bit of revolt risk here and there. Could spend 20 military power here. That's not that much. I think it's worth it. And here we'll grab them if they rise up. You can go here. To prevent this province from rising up. Ooh. Well, good. We got uh, good rolls there. Let's see. We had a general as well, so that's probably why. And we have not much money. Steadily declining. Recall the diplomat. Wait for these guys to siege this down, so we can accept their demands. And lose a lot of prestige, but hey, what can you do? Hmm... Yeah, mercantilism is right. So, should we go for Ceylon? Maybe. Ceylon is one of these areas where um, Western nations like to take uh, a piece. So we might be able to westernize of it. Not that I think that we'll be able to westernize right now. Because the Western powers haven't reached this far yet. Though they're on their way, with Castile here leading the way. 
Let's see. Prestige from land battles? Absolutely not. We want technology. Above everything else. And we're already focusing in it. Alright, let's accept you. And this should no longer have any revolt risk, which is nice. Hmm. Alright, this claim is almost done. Oh, you are doing something. You're at war with Sistan. Oh, that is good for us. That means that we should be able to... Let's see here. We don't have any war exhaustion or anything. Should we go for more more land? We could probably crush this quite easily by um, combining our stacks here. Hmm. If we attack them, we would call in uh, Konkana, which is already fighting Sistan. Let's see how Sistan handles this. They will probably wipe the floor with Konkana. Ah, indeed they did. So I see no real reason to not attack them. I mean, no one gains any aggressive expansion to the east because they're all Nestorians and don't care what happens to Janes. So, um, yeah, we do have some manpower reserves to take from. I'd rather have the next tech because they have a... Actually, we should wait for the next tech. But it's so far off. They will have a tactic advantage of um, 0.25, and I'm not sure if that will tip it into their favor by a lot. Serious, seriously, though, I think it's... Oh, is that the difference? No, Sistan has... Yeah, no, they have the same technology. I thought maybe Konkana had 15 and Sistan had 14. Hmm. I'm hesitating here. Should I hesitate? Denouncement of sect practices. Awesome. Oh, and we had a, a mission. A uh, crush Zetia. Why? Well, I think this would be an opportune moment to do this. Sistan would join. We have more than twice the amount of troops, so even with tactics, we should be able to take them on. And we want to take Raishur Doab as our objective. Do we have our force limits filled up? Yes, we do. So let's do this. Raishur Doab. They will call upon Panduanado and Konkana. One of those is yourself. Alright, so what terrain is there here? Grasslands, mostly, and then desert and plains. So we should probably pincer attack them. See no real reason not to. Our army is fully paid. Get over there. Yep. Worked out like a charm. Right, so you just split up into several stacks. Go everywhere. And then some... Let's move you over there. Alright, well, we have to go for the bureaucrat candidate, because otherwise we will not be able to convert anything. Alright, let's go for uh, missionary strength. Have you take care of this little army up here? Actually, let's split and have half go. Oh, right, 8,000 troops. Oh, it's Konkana's troops. Right. Sistan should be able to take care of them. Now the question is, will anyone that matters get any aggressive expansion? I'm thinking of Samarkand primarily. Do they even have any? Zero. So I might be able to take a lot of land here. We do have some admin power. Not that much though. Ooh, diplomatic ideas, unjustified demands, and aggressive expansion impact. Now that is something I'd like. Though, of course, I need to say, this is too good to pass up. I will simply have to drag this war out until I have more uh, diplomatic power to, to make the actual unjustified demands with. 
Okay, Sistan, you just camp out in their capital while their troops are replenishing up there. We have several lazy diplomats. Where should I send them? Damot? Yeah, sure. Anywhere else? Um, Dacia? Uh, okay, sure. Doesn't really matter. <laughs> Well, this is working out awesomely for us. Do we have any claims on uh, Konkana? No. Right, so I'll simply let Sistan take what they want from there. And it looks like Samarkand is taking on Asni. Which is actually good, because if they uh, fully annex them, I can pick a new rival. Oh man, we need to get one more point. Let's see here. We are not um, embargoing any of our rivals. Sutia, let's embargo. Issue embargo. There we go, 50. Well, alright. This is awesome. Raishur Duab is taken. Alright, this is suboptimal in many ways. I do not want to lose 100 diplomatic power, so I'll simply have to take the stability hit. It's uh, too bad. Too bad. The reason being, I cannot spend any admin on uh, stability, because I'm going to need it for coring. If the cores are expensive, that is, which I presume they will be. Um, is this where I'm converting? No, it is not. Well, okay then. I'll accept your demands. No! Division in the council! You can meet up here. Actually, I might just take these rebels out. Their leader is not that good. But what are they fighting in? Grasslands, desert plains. Alright. Let's uh, make a leader out of our republic. Dude, our Republican leader. Get in there. Okay, that was easy. Easier than I thought. By far. We almost have this in lockdown. Oh, of, of course, we need to uh, siege up stuff here as well. Not that I'm sure that we'll need it. What we need is to... Um, and get some more diplomatic power so we can make more unjustified demands. Might as well kill these. There's some tactics in action there. Let's uh, wipe them out. Awesome. Let's do this. <laughs> Nowhere to run. All right. Can we make the demands we'd like? Where do we have claims? There. All right, so we could do this, and we could send the demand. It would cost us... Um, no diplomatic power. Right, so each of these will cost us 20... Okay, 21, 42. Well... This seems uh, reasonable. Who would get the aggressive expansion? Panduanado, Konkana, Maru, Ceylon, Samarkand would get 8. <laughs> right. So I am satisfied with this. Thank you. What a lovely haul. Alright, so let's see here. Where do I have the most revolt risk in Kongu? You can go to Raishur Doab and let's start coring everything. And we even have admin enough to bump up our stability one. No, we don't. We would like to core everything anyway, so the stability is cheaper. Lost conquest against Panduanadu. And it's just a military idea that we can take. I'd rather have the tech. Let's see if we can do some harsh treatment here. That is of uh, reasonable uh, quality for the price. 50, 30, 
40, 40. Now I, I, I think I'll rather just take the revolts. Alright, we managed to convert Malabar. Where next? Oh, this will take a while. Bijapur? Maybe? Or actually, let's go for Telangana. The reason being, uh, Telangana is not that revolt. Uh, well, it is, actually. But it uh, it will look nice on the, re on the religious map mode to have this converted because it's such a large province. How is the rest of the world faring? Kriok Lochlan has gotten some land back here. Amazing. Probably from um, rebels, I guess. Hmm. They've also got this. And they've annexed Northland. Are they making a comeback? Hmm. Who knows? They're at war with the Aztec and the Maya. Alright, well, let's construct these cores. I do not want Yesia. Reduce overextension. No, claim our rival's province, Cochin. Yes. Absolutely. That is indeed something I'd like to do. We're uh, starting to um, look strong and healthy. What is happening? Is Maru attacking Sistan and winning? Just because Sistan is camping out with their troops here in their capital without doing anything. Well, alright. Now they bounced back. I hope they annex, annex this. Just to connect up their land. Let's recall all of the diplomats. And uh, no revolt so far. Let's fill up our force limits. Uh, let's see here. Some South Indian infantry. Five of them. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, and we can bump up... No, we will not bump up stability until all the cores are done. I always make that mistake. Sheng, are you suffering uh, defeat at the hand of Sutia? I wouldn't have thought that of you. Bijapur. The three fire guy can take care of you. Ah, lost a lot of men. Fortunately, we do have a manpower reserve. Thank you for the military power. What's the next mission going to be? I guess reduce overextension is better than nothing. Even though we cannot use a level 3 uh, advisor. That mission should really scale. Rather than just give us a level 3 advisor when we are very far from uh, affording one. Kanara and Razor Duab. Goody, then we just have the core uh, Ginji and Kongu. Then we need to take the tip here. Let's see, how long is the um, truce? We have a truce with uh, Panduanadu for uh, 10 years. Same with Konkana. Right, you guys, get down to Raishur Duab, I think. Yeah. Hmm, <clears throat> recruitment time, yeah. We just recruited what we needed anyway. Ooh, nice. Samarkand is uh, having uh, revolt problems here. That is good for us, because that means they need to take care of it before they can even plan an attack on us. And they have... Uh, I thought they had claimed one province, but it seems like the claim has either expired or I uh, dreamt about it. And it wasn't actually a real thing that happened. Ginji. Um, you can go down there and take care of them. Good. How uh, far along is the missionary? Mm, not that far. Ah, finally! Military tactics. I guess we're still far behind. Military technology 17, yeah. Indeed. That's because of their... Uh... No, actually, Muslim tech group, we are Indian, right? Yeah, it shouldn't be that big of a difference if we focus everything into military. Let's see, admin idea, available mercenaries? Definitely not. Actually, Samarkand, what ideas do you have? Uh, they have defensive, religious, and trade. 
I thought they might have had um, the military idea group that made military tech cheaper, but apparently not. And Sheng, what is happening? Are you losing a war for real? I have a hard time believing that. Sheng! Yeah, you have 80,000 men. You can't lose. You're just uh, occupied somewhere else, aren't you? This is Sukhothai. Yeah. The troops are probably just stationed somewhere where we can't... Uh, where, they, where they're going to strike back after they've sieged something. Right, Ginje is part of our patrimony. And Kongu. We finished our mission and... Claim Silhet. Where is that? It's over here. Free power, thank you. By the way, one of our rivals have been annexed. That means that we should be able to choose a new one. No, apparently not. Why can we not choose a new rival? We should be able to choose at least... Um, Samarkand, in my opinion. <laughs> what is Sistan doing? Just siege back these and annex Mewar. No, my military power. We've lost 100 military power so far. Right, let's boost stability. Bam! No more bad events. And, uh, well, we're looking strong indeed. Would have been really nice if we had uh, religious ideas. Oh, man, we're earning a lot of money. What do we want? Do we want uh, trade efficiency? Or prestige? How much do we earn from trade? 6.81 Would we rather have prestige? I think so. So that would make us um, stay at about 35 prestige steady. Instead of dropping down into the zeros. Our general is dead. That is indeed not very good. We need military power to hire a new one. Which we're going to do because we... Uh... Oh, nice general. Hmm, yeah, I guess, um, maybe one more episode. I'm not sure if I want to break truce against these. The truce lasts for quite long. I guess the main problem here is that the AI will be unable to handle all of these uh, religious revolts. So we should try to convert as much as possible for them. Let's say one more episode. Yes. Thank you for watching and...